The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs urges the public to be on alert and to take the necessary preventative measures in relation to the situation of dengue fever cases in St. Lucia. As we continue to go through the rainy season, a period which is known for an increase in mosquito-borne diseases. Dengue fever is a mosquito-borne illness caused by the Aedes aegypti mosquito, which can be found naturally in St. Lucia. It is a seasonal disease often occurring during the periods of heavy rainfall. The last outbreak of dengue fever in St. Lucia occurred in 2020, where over 1,300 confirmed cases were recorded. From January 1, 2024 to date, 40 confirmed cases of dengue fever have been recorded on island. It is important to note that 50% of these cases were recorded in the month of August, which is a 200% increase in documented cases from the previous month. This increase in cases aligns with the seasonal rainfall patterns observed during the rainy season, where conditions are favorable for mosquito breeding. Although the dengue fever cases have been reported throughout the island, the communities in the south and southeast of the island have recorded more cases. Most infections have been observed in persons 25 years and younger, with toddlers between the ages of 1 to 4 years accounting for 25% of these cases. While most cases have presented with mild to moderate symptoms, there have been cases of severe dengue fever requiring hospitalization. Persons with severe dengue can recover fully with close monitoring and adequate medical management. If you become infected with the dengue virus, you may experience high fever of 40 degrees Celsius, severe headache, pain behind the eyes, muscle and joint pains, nausea, vomiting, swollen lymph nodes, rash. You can become infected with dengue virus more than once as four serotypes of the dengue virus known as dengue 1 to 4 exist. Reinfection with a different serotype from that of a previous infection can result in a more severe form of the disease. Symptoms of severe dengue include severe abdominal pain, persistent vomiting, rapid breathing, bleeding gums or nose, fatigue, restlessness, blood in vomit or stool, being thirsty, pale and cold skin, feeling weak. Should you exhibit any of these symptoms, you should seek immediate medical attention at your nearest wellness center. Early diagnosis and treatment are crucial in preventing complications, particularly in severe cases of dengue fever. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs will continue to keep the public informed for regular updates and encourages everyone to remain vigilant and proactive in preventing the spread of dengue.